with a character you can dress in sexy outfits and careers to choose from which include stripping, this website looks like it should be for adults only. But there's nothing to stop children from accessing my minx. I've just logged onto the website telling them I'm a seven-year-old girl. Now, there's a lot of graphic content on my minx, definitely not suitable for children, but it doesn't seem to bother them because they've accepted me and I'm in. When inside the website, you're encouraged to buy things like virtual condoms and anti-baby pills. You can even dress your character provocatively in a g-string and stockings. But the fact children can access this material so easily is quite a concern. I'll probably block it personally. I won't really let my kids go on there. I think seven's just way too young. The children so young shouldn't have access to that sort of thing anyway. I'm against that. I think the children of seven shouldn't be thinking about things like that and probably most children of seven don't know anything about that. Another feature is the adoption centre. In rather poor taste considering the recent earthquake, you can adopt a Haitian orphan. Christopher Evans is the creator of My Minx. We spoke to him when another of his websites, MissBimbo.com, provoked controversy. He refused an interview but told Five News the target market for the website was females in their late teens. But if young children can log on, it's likely they will. So how could material like this affect them? I'm very worried about this website because I think it could be incredibly damaging to young children. You cannot accelerate the sexual development of children. In fact, if you do, you're often storing up more trouble for the future. So I'm worried that children will not understand what they're being exposed to and could be very damaged by it. My Minx has 30,000 users. Its creators say the material is suitable for their target market, but parents of younger kids may not think buying things like imaginary contraception is appropriate for them.